Welcome to a new review. It is time for a collab between a Dutch brewery and a brewery from France. Um, Compan, uh, I have to rectify something first. I The last review I did uh, last week, I uh, kind of screwed up. I told Compan was a brewery from uh, Rotterdam. They are not a brewery from Rotterdam. They are a brewery from The Hague. So sorry about that, guys. But um, this is a beer from Compan in collaboration with uh, Prism. And they are a, a brewery from France. Uh, I went to a beer festival uh, at Brauda Frontal, uh, which uh, this brewery was also uh, Prism. A couple of the of, of their beers, which were pretty damn nice. Um, and Compan is, yeah. I love the brewery. It's a really nice brewery. They do all kinds of things. They do, uh, this is a Pilsner, for example. Uh, they do barrel aged stuff. They do hazies. They do stouts, porters, kind of everything. But uh, this is kind of a cool one. It's a beer with the name. What's the name? Down under. See down here, it's under there. Um, it's a uh, New Zealand uh, Pilsner, 5.4%, and it's hop with Nelson Sauve in, in Mortuega. Um, give her a binge down under. I have loved it. Uh, not been to New Zealand, but been to Australia. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm kind of curious about this. Hey, the ingredients are water. Body malt, uh, rice, hops, and yeast. Um, yeah, let's open it up and see what it's like. Really into my craft pilsners, and I really love New Zealand pilsners. Really love New Zealand hops. So let's pour it in the glass. Oh, that's a nice light yellow color. Look at that. Like I told you, Prism is a brewery from France. I don't know exactly where they're from. Oh, that, that color looks really nice. Um, light yellow, slightly a bit of a haze. Uh, white colored hat. Looks apart. Let's go to the nose. Oh, you can smell those hops. I'm mean, getting some... Uh, Melon, a bit of white grapes. Really nice. Let's have a sip. Cheers. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, that's nice. I've been getting some stone fruits as well. Uh, melon, white grapes, a bit dry. Getting that um, it's really got that crispy feel from a pilsner to it. Um, this is nice. This is really nice, really crushable on a hot summer day. It's really awesome. It's on a hot summer day. Uh, pour it all day over here. Uh, basically, summer is over over here, I think. Let's hope not. But uh, this would be really nice in the sun. Um, so overall, this is a uh, pretty awesome collaboration, if you ask me. Yeah. This is really nice. I love this. Um, yeah. One of the better New Zealand uh, Pilsners I've had. This year so far, I think. Um, it's also got that uh, nice maltiness to it from a Pilsner. It's crispy. Um, um, a bit of a melon. Um, uh, stone fruits. Uh, dry, a bit of white grapes. Um, it's all in there. So, really nice. If you want to know the score, go to my tab. You can find me there. I'm also on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Threads. 
Um, next week, we will be back with another review. What? In which style? With brewery? I have no idea. Every time I'm going to do a review, I'm just going to open the fridge and think, hey, we might as well review that. So we don't have a plan. So if you want to know, you have to look next week, next Wednesday. Um, that's about it for this review. Hopefully I will see you again soon next week with another review. Cheers.